Well, hey folks, PC7 here, and welcome back to the channel, and welcome back to Richie Bell for Farm Sim 19. So I finished my rice harvest, and uh, I see the field needs lime, by the way. So we are going to have to buy ourselves the appropriate machinery to do that. And uh, I couldn't finish emptying the harvester. Even our monster truck here just couldn't take it all. There's a half a million liters of rice in there. Yes, I know. Uh, it's, uh, that'd be enough to keep me fed for a year. Alright. Let's run this out. dumper in the silo then we can get that guy emptied and that will allow us to uh, get on with the next big field up there which I believe is full of millet I'm guessing I think at this point it's been two days since I've looked at it oh I saw that telephone pole my whole life flashed before my eyes it takes a while these days let me tell you anyway I do apologize for there being no episodic well yesterday um, unfortunately, about, uh, 8.20 yesterday, about 8.20 yesterday morning, um, there was a flicker, flicker, gone, and that was our electricity until about, oh, five, five, just after five yesterday afternoon, yeah, apparently they've been changing a few poles down on the, uh, the main drag down below the building here and although when they change poles they don't actually have to shut anything off they kind of tie the old pole to the new one and blah 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 and leave everything hanging and then they just sort of transfer them over bundle by bundle but I guess a few poles again a little too quick a few poles down the road uh, I guess I don't know if they dropped the bundle or what but yeah it took uh, it took pretty much all day to, for them to put Humpty Dumpty back together again. So I do apologize, but without uh, without electricity, I don't have internet. You know, not that it would have done me that much good. I still sort of need to run my computer, but yeah, that's that's what happened. So I do apologize, guys. I wasn't uh, wasn't taking a holiday or anything. It was kind of a Yeah, I don't know why I went all the way out that end. So what we'll do is we'll get this harvester set up. Get them running. And then... Uh, That's what I thought. It's actually a little ways out. And then we're going to take this truck down and buy us a metric ton. In fact, we might get really exotic and go with a metric crap ton. Oh, that would be it rather than the horn of lime. Because, yeah, we've got some spreading to do. Let's take you over to this. Now, this field is a little bit gibbly shaped, as we can see here. Um, so where's a good edge? I think up the far corner. And I think what I want to do first, I'm going to run one headland manually along here just to get us up a bit away from this road because I don't want I, I know sometimes what they'll do is rather than do some fancy dance they'll actually stop the harvest shy of a road so I'm gonna assume this thing being what the heck's going on here this isn't a field that's ready no this is only barely growing Ew. Okie dokie. Yeah, there we go. Huh. So, we've got this. What the heck are we doing here? 
Oh, that's the cotton harvester. That's right. So this is a long way from being ready. Hmm. All right. What is field eight? It's yellow. It's sunflowers. Is it? Or is it wheat? Oh, let's uh, do that. Okay. And. Winnie, winnie, moo, moo, moo. Oh, crap. Okay, well, that's all right. I can see from here that it's sunflowers. So. <laughs> yes. Good stuff. There we go. Now, um, yeah, it'll be a while before you'll be harvesting that, pal. A while indeed. All right, let's shut you down, though. All right, um, oh, you, yeah. Two percent, how could you be at, oh, my goodness. Well, good for you, I guess. All right, carry on. All right, nice. So, hmm. Okie dokie, let's... Let's think about this. Yeah, I think we should pick up the old eight. Go and deal with it. And as I said, we're going to go and get ourselves a truckload of lime. That's going to cost a good bit of money, but it's also going to get us through for a while, hopefully. So. Awesome. And if we have a look here... We'll see that our lime station is right there, so let's give it a tag. Awesome. Alright. Ah, oh, okay, never mind. I was just going to say, I thought I bought a corn header, but uh, it's sitting at the parking lot of the shop. We never brought it home. All right, got to get some lime. Something else we have to deal with, of course, is getting this straw up off the fields. So, yeah. But, one thing at a time, I am going the right way. No, I'm not. I was going to go and buy animal fodder. All righty. Go, baby, go. I'm glad you wind out pretty tall, because we got catching up to do, so. Let's do that, thing. There we are. 100, 105. 105 is alive. Alright. And you could have, like, a game of ping pong with your passenger on that freaking table in the middle. <laughs> Holy cow, that's a big bit of gear. Scary much? <laughs> Alright. Actually, it handles pretty good considering the speeds we're doing here. So a couple of the crops aren't ready, eh? Hmm. Now, I haven't gotten to go on, and uh, I wanted to get a couple of things recorded here this morning, so I haven't been on. 
but uh, I noticed that someone had asked me how long it actually takes for the hemp to uh, to ripen. Um, I don't know how long it takes in real life. As far as the game goes, um, I haven't actually grown it in a non-seasons game. Because, I mean, obviously in the seasons game, you can harvest it right, when the appropriate part of fall comes up. Um, in a non-seasons, the hemp I just harvested was already ready. So I have no long, no idea at all. Um, can I get that to disappear? There we go. Alright, let's grab some lime. Um, so yeah, I don't know how long it actually takes under normal, normal days. So if anybody knows, let me know, because I wouldn't mind uh, answering the viewer's question. Lime, yes. I don't think we need a half a million liters, do we? Let's go with a couple hundred thousand. And that'll probably get us through most of the uh, opening parts of the game. There's a nice looking field, eh? How do you handle with half a load on? Whoops. Gaping out the side window and driving across a bridge. Wow. Like a Ferrari. All right, let's get this back. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Mad truck driver. There we go. Yes. And cut a little cornerage there. Whoops. <laughs> Almost missed the farm. Can't be missing the farm. Yes, I know. The sheep think I'm just a madman. Alright, here we go. Let's fill this up. Whoa. Certainly won't fill it up. Bloody better not. It's all we'd need, eh? There's no room in the silos, they're full of lime. Oh well. At least on this fresh version of the map, I know that there isn't a bunch of them hidden under the silo. <laughs> there we are. Beautiful. Okay. We certainly don't want to take the harvester all the way there, do we? Um, if we buy field eight, yeah, that's a long way. Well, I suppose we're going to be really close to the shop anyway. But do we want it? Hmm. How muchy? Three hundred and seventy-four thousand. Holy smokes! Okay. Yeah. What the heck? All right. So. I don't want to get in there. Booger off. Thank you. <laughs> I guess we're going to have to take this guy up the road. So let's beacon up. I was going to take the tractor up and drag the header and trailer down, but seeing as field 8 is kind of in that general direction, 
Let's head along for the ride. Well, that's kind of a useless... What's that supposed to be looking at? That top mirror. Hmm. No, no. no, well, there you go. Yeah, that'd be a useful display if we were actually in a field. Okay, here we go. Not a lot of people out today. Hmm. Strange. Seems to be a nice sunny day, just like it is in real life here in uh, beautiful Powell River, British Columbia. The Sunshine Coast and all of that. Yes. Alright, now I believe right at uh, the closest entrance here is where I left. Untrela and stuff there it is look at that look at that um yeah we're not even gonna pretend we're capable oh it probably would have worked fine excellent hook me up baby all right now <clears throat> Excuse me. Let's go to a larger version. Alright. Anybody coming? We're just gonna loop around the block. Go back to our mini map version of our mini map. Love that. <coughs> Do -do -do -do. In summer camp for the critters. <laughs> All right, we should be uh, right past our purchase here. There's the field in question. Ooh, looking good. Anybody coming? Don't be anybody coming. There we go. Oh, that's right, that's an actual trailer. I was trying to fold it up. I'm going, how come the thing's unfolding? I want the trailer bit to fold up. Well, that would be why. There we are. Oh, just in time. Well, I'd say that stuff's uh, ready to harvest. It looks plenty ripe. Eh? Yeah. All right, let's unfold the, the big machine. Go get me some sunflowers, man. Nice. Woohoo! How are you doing there, Cotton Jenny? Oh. Spaz Bob. Okay. Still got a ways to go. Uh, no, I don't actually want you this time. Let's go and hop on our Trakatori. Please start the engine. Alright, let's 
go see about spending some more of our money. Money? Alright, you guys are going to regret going out this morning. Da -da -da -da. Light the fires and kick the tires. The sucker's going to fly. Yahoo! Whoa! No, I think that seat came up so quick it probably put my head right through the roof of the tractor. Alright, I have to turn the uh, air damper on that thing up a little tighter. Yeah, we're not slowing down in a hurry. Oh, <laughs> we just made that corner, I'll tell you what. Okay, we're here. So, a couple of things we need to purchase. Um, yeah, first of all, we need a way to make in the lime go everywhere. So, fertilizer technology. Yes, indeed. And... Uh -huh, uh -huh. Now, this guy won't do thins. He'll just do fatter standards. So, extension, as much as we can get. Uh, is that your biggest extension? Let's go this way. Yeah, that's your biggest one. Uh, we're going to have the 6 meter spreading unit attached to the bottom. And, uh, yeah, we're going to call her there. Yes, I would. Thank you. Now, the other thing that we require to purchase... Ooh, never seen this before. Lime spray... Oh, set, oh, I see. Oh. Oh. Uh-huh. Okay. I didn't realize that. Now, remember that... Um, Oldman 102 actually sent me a pack... And I didn't realize that it included a lime spreader. What's the difference? No, I don't care. Nothing else changes. All right. All right. So there's our lime spreader. The other thing that we, we, we require is a wagon of the forage variety. Here we are, a loading wagon, in fact. Okay, this is the... Ah. Oh, I see. This one's got a windrower built onto the front of it, eh? And holds 9 billion or something liters. Oh. And cost no money. <laughs> All right. Well, we already own that, so we're just going to go with that. Okay. I'm just wondering if there were any mods in this range that were included. Plows? Well, a couple, but I think these were ones I already had. 15 meter, 20 meter, yeah. Nice. Nice, 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 but that's an actual plow, isn't it? Because our cedar doesn't do anything as near as I can tell. So... What do we got here? 18.2. Yeah, 24 meter. So we'll end up having to buy one of these as well. Wow. All right. Ooh, look at the size of these puppies. Right. 
let's take our liminator and head on home. Look at the size of this monkey. Man. And it holds, what, 75,000, eh? So we'll get to fill it, what, three times? <laughs> Alright, we're gonna make the corner before you fill us it brakes. No, well, if you didn't put the brakes on, I pity the food. Cut this one a bit so we don't throw the trailer across the next field. Yeah, fill me up, man. Look at her go. Gotcha. Yeah, rainy then. Oh. Now it can feel it's got something on it. Let me tell you. Wow. All right. What's going on here? Just all of a sudden started pulling to one side. I think that's maybe too much weight for it. Wait for it. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah, it might be just a bit too much weight. Uh, I thought it needed limed. What the heck? Oh, it's the next one up, maybe. This is oh, this is our hemp field. It's the rice field that needs limed. Right. Okay. So this one can be just straight up cultivated. It's the next one we gotta deal with. So I've only got this one tractor, which is kind of an issue. Yeah, this trailer is way too heavy. That's kind of cute. <laughs> Alright, so there's nothing to unfold, but I think it's got a pretty good spread, eh? So, let's go to a long waveform. I'm going to guess the edge here. Now, do we need to open it? We do. I kind of thought it looked like a manure spreader, eh? It's got the same action going on. Alright, how are we for... Perfect. All right, well, that'll work, eh? That will work indeed. Ooh, did she ever go through it quick? That's all right. All right, well... Let's hire up a fella to do this for us. And let's have a look in our shop here. Under Tracatories, large evu. What did we pay for that thing? Yeah, 3290 bucks. That's a dang good deal, you know? <laughs> oh, that's cheaty as
as heck, but I guess it doesn't matter. I mean, the money comes in one way or the other, right? Uh, we're going to go with the big puppy. Uh, what do we got here? Wheel weights, wide tires, wide tires, and weights. Hmm. See, I like these guys with running narrow twins. 530 horse. So it's still enough to do the job. I mean, I realize they're a lot more money. Oh, it's $400,000. Hmm. Oh, yeah, I guess. It's just too tempting. Why did you have to make it so cheap? You're appealing to my cheapness, man. Uh... Okay. Well, you freaking tuna, you're leaving a big chunk down the middle. Oh, you they fine be that way. How are you doing, man? Good, good. And you? Lovely. All right, there we are. One brand new fuzzy nose vent. Alright. You know what I think we should do here? We haven't done this for any of our tractors yet. Weights. What do we got? We should have some fent weights. Fent weight? Here we go. A big guy, 3,300 kilo. Hmm. Yeah. Alright, where are we here? There she goes. Alright. Yep. Oh. <laughs> Good job, you pinhead. There we are. Ooh, that's pulling the snout down. I like that. See that? Check it out. Alright, look at this thing. Thang. Look at this thing. But I think we're also whoa, well, well into the episode, guys. So I think I'm going to call it here. We barely made it through there. If we run into traffic on this bridge, we're pretty much hooped. Um, beacons, because that'll save me. Oh, God, we barely fit. Come on, go, 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 go. Oh, here comes the cars. Go, go. Oh, good, none of them turned this way. Ha, ha, ha. We, whoa, Lord, we've just about done it there. Whew. Oh, helper E needs some help, too. So, I think I'm going to call it there, guys. We're getting a little bit of progress here on the farm. Not doing much with the factories yet, but, uh, well, we got an awful lot of busy work here yet before we're ready for those, I think. Hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, you know what to do. Hit that like button. I don't want to hit anything along here. And until next time, well, take care of each other, folks. And ciao for now.